I want to welcome all of you. Isn't this place gorgeous? <laughs> we spent probably five years working on the redo of David Geffen Hall, and COVID ended up being as difficult as it was for all of us, we ended up being able to take advantage of the fact that we were already out of the hall and accelerate the, pro pro the process by over two years. And we ended up bringing it in on time and on budget, which is really very exciting for all of us. But more important, I think what we've created is a magnificent hall with incredibly incredible sound that we finally have a home that befits the New York Philharmonic. So we welcome you all. Oscar? Well, I think that the, we had many objectives when we were doing the hall. <clears throat> but I'll just tell you two of them. One was to create a space which not only a beautiful space, but a space where the orchestra has a better ability to relate with the audience and vice versa, so that you can feel a, a, an intimacy, if you will, with the orchestra just producing the music, and so that you both live in this musical environment together. And, and hopefully we have done that. And, uh, of course, there's much more of a surround the orchestra in the middle approach to this. And the second, perhaps the first objective, was to, after 60 years, to get the acoustics really to, <laughs> to be truly worthy of the best orchestra in the world. And, Also, I just want to have a special call out to the leaders, uh, the president of the New York Philharmonic, Deborah Porter, and, <laughs> and, uh, and the president of Lincoln Center, Henry Tint, who obviously led this effort. So thank you, and uh, enjoy the concert. Thank you. Have a great time. Enjoy.